Rain is falling, but it's the changeover to at least sleet and possibility of some freezing rain before it ends with snow. So this is all going to evolve over the course of our evening commute. Go figure. Remember the good old days when it was 60 degrees? Yeah, yeah. yesterday. Well, it was right around <laughs> 1 o'clock in the morning. Uh, Daniel, you'll attest to it as you came in early this morning. It was mild. We're down to 34 here at our studios. You know, this is a razor-thin line between liquid and frozen, and it's all about the critical temperatures, which have dropped now at the airport to 30. 35, 34 at our studios. It is still liquid in and around Marion County, though at times few ice pellets have mixed down. But you can see where the transition zone is. It's just to our west into Hendricks County, Boone County. They're seeing ice accumulation now, snow up into Lafayette. And all of this will take its time slowly migrating to the east and southeast as much colder air works its way in. And the main storm system passes along the Ohio River just to our south uh, later on tonight. Still could see an excess of four to six inches of snow in our far northwestern communities, but it will be the transition over to some sleet and freezing rain that gets underway and will likely be completed here in Indianapolis by 6 p.m. The National Weather Service has expanded the winter weather advisory to include that of Marion County, Hancock and Hendricks County, and even as far south as Clay County. Again, we're now looking at significant snow accumulation, perhaps an inch, and that's a combination of snow and sleet, but there will be more icing set down before at least we change over to the snow and of course the totals will ramp up in northwestern portions of the state down 24 degrees we're at 35 and now 25 29 in Lafayette we'll turn over to sleet and then eventually some freezing rain in the mix as well we'll end this with a period of snow and then the storm darts off to the east and takes the precipitation with it wind chill makes it feel like it's over 30 degrees colder yeah it was 60 degrees it'll get slick and cold overnight with uh, this storm system ending with snow, but I've got another 60 degree day or two in my forecast. I'll show you when in just a few minutes.